Can you transfer Microsoft Office from one PC to another? If you're wondering how to move Microsoft Office from your old computer to a new one, you're in the right place. Let's break down the steps and options you have. First, it's important to know that transferring Microsoft Office is relatively straightforward, but it depends on the type of license you have. If you're using Microsoft 365, which is a subscription-based service, the process is quite simple. You just need to deactivate Microsoft Office on your old computer and then sign in with your Microsoft 365 account on the new computer. To deactivate, sign in to your account on the Microsoft website, go to the My Account section, and select Deactivate Install under the Install Information section. Once deactivated, you can install Microsoft Office on your new computer using your subscription. If you don't have a Microsoft 365 subscription, you might have a perpetual license, which means you own the software outright. In this case, you can transfer the software, but you need to follow some specific steps. For example, if you have a retail or full packaged product, FPP, license, you can uninstall Microsoft Office from your old computer and then install it on your new one using the product key. Make sure to remove the software from the old computer to avoid licensing conflicts. Another way to transfer Microsoft Office is by using a USB drive or cloud storage. You can copy the Microsoft Office installation folder to a USB drive or upload it to a cloud service like OneDrive or Google Drive. Then you can download the folder to your new computer and install it. However, this method may not work due to Microsoft's protection mechanisms, so it's often better to use a third-party transfer tool like EaseUS to do PC Trans, which can help you transfer the software more smoothly. For those who prefer a more manual approach, you can also check the license type of your Microsoft Office and transfer it accordingly. For instance, if you have an OEM, Original Equipment Manufacturer license, it cannot be transferred unless the PC and the licenses are transferred together. If you have a volume license agreement, there are specific rules and forms you need to follow to transfer the licenses. It's also crucial to ensure that both computers have compatible operating systems and versions of Microsoft Office to avoid any compatibility issues during the transfer process. In summary, whether you're using a Microsoft 365 subscription or a perpetual license, transferring Microsoft Office to a new computer is definitely possible with the right steps. Just remember to deactivate the software on your old computer if you're using a subscription and follow the specific guidelines for your license type to ensure a smooth transfer.